Hey, what's going on guys? Dave the Usher here, and we're doing another mailbox opening. Yeah, I went to the uh, UPS store, and I checked my mailbox the other day, and there was a couple packages. So, uh, awesome stuff. I actually get notified by email. Been a little busy. I had to get over there and uh, pick up these awesome packages, because, you know, I just couldn't wait any longer. Real excited here. Um, like I said, we have a couple things I'm pretty pumped for. I, uh, I looked at where they came from already, of course. Uh, we're going to start with this right here. It seems like this one came from Vegas. You know, simple little, simple envelope. Kind of feeling around and kind of tell what's inside. So I'm just going to open this up here and have a lot of fun. Maybe there's a note or something inside. Uh, looks like there's something. Pull out the note first, you know. Pull. Could be a receipt. Okay, here's a little, here's a little note here. Dave, I just watched your Mario 3 gameplay and you and Volv hated the sun. Well, in this game, you get to praise the sun. Enjoy from Kadeem. How you doing, man? This is like the second time this guy is uh, is sending me something. That's uh, that's awesome. What are we praising? And this is uh, receipt. So what are we praising here? Praising the sun. Uh, it's a video game. I can tell by feeling. Package, obvious. But uh, any of you kind of have an idea, you know, maybe a, a new video game, Praising the Sun, has something to do with the sun? I don't know. I have no idea. Do you guys know? It's <laughs> Dark Souls. Hey, awesome stuff, man. This is, uh, this is kind of a surprise, right? Okay, I, uh, I don't know anything about Dark Souls. Dark Souls. Let's check this out. Prepare to die. <laughs> that's what it says. Prepare to die. That's, that's nice. From the makers of Demon's Soul. All right, cool. Tense dungeon crawling, fearsome enemy encounters, groundbreaking online features, uh, orgies. No, it doesn't say that. This this could be a fun game. I don't know. I think I've seen like good positive reviews out of Dark Souls. I've I've heard the name mentioned. I think Scorch or or uh, Shadow Zack, you know, one of them were doing it. I don't know, but uh, definitely heard about Dark Souls, and I gotta check it out, man. I actually want to do a stream soon so the next time i do a stream i gotta put this in i gotta check it out and if it's good man you know i could be hooked you know like uh my girlfriend ty got me on to uh, mass effect the mass effect series so you know maybe uh maybe it'll be the same here maybe it'll be the same with uh, dark souls anyway kadeem thank you very much man this is great i'm very happy with this and i uh, can't wait to play it thanks man okay Second box. Okay, we're going with this right here. Big solid square here. Okay, um, I'm looking at the uh, the label. This is from John from Tennessee. Uh, unless it's a different John from Tennessee, I believe it's uh, the same John that has uh, sent me uh, items before. Items I still have, and I need to make a food video uh, for them for those items in one of the previous. Mailbox openings. I uh, I got a package from John. I opened it up, and there was all this gnarly food. I gotta get in touch with John. John, I gotta get in touch with you. Um, I don't know if this is more the same or different stuff. No idea. Uh, let's knife it open. You know. I gotta get around to. I have all that food like in a box, like near the kitchen, and like I want to. I want to go. I, I gotta get ready to go. If there is if there is food in here, let's make let's make a preview promise. Preview promise time. If there is, you know, any kind of food items in here from John again, uh, I I vow to eat uh, the most weird, unusual item. You know, if if there's anything like really crazy or like messed up in here, or multiple items, I vow to eat like the the weirdest and craziest one. Let's do it, man. Woof. Okay. <laughs> uh oh. It, I can always take this out in editing. No, no, no. I, I did the, I did the vow. Vow's the vow. Oh man, gotta pick this up again. Uh, there we go. Whoa. Okay, that helps. That helps. That's. Were you expecting that? Okay. Well. Stay down. Down. Okay. What do we got here? We got. Well, I can already kind of see. I don't think this is that gross, in my opinion. This right here is quail eggs in a can. We got quail eggs in a can. Let's see the quails. Yeah, quail eggs. They're like uh, you. You would eat like quail eggs at like a fancy occasion. You know, a, a big ball. I don't know. 
They're just like little eggs, you know, like little little tiny eggs. And these are in a can. Um, ingredients. <laughs> look, look at the thumbs up. What, is, what does that mean? Thumbs up. Okay. Number one is like thumbs up, number one. Like you kind of see that? Number one. Number one. <laughs> okay. Uh, ingredients, quail eggs, water, and salt. Good stuff. Product of Taiwan. Well, this could be the front runner. By the way, I wonder if there's a note in here. Kind of have to... I'll just kind of remove... Oh, it's everywhere. I'll just remove some of this stuff. Oh, there is a note. Should do the note first. Whoa. Should do the... This box. Let's put the box over here for now. Okay. Should do the note first. <clears throat> Alright. John, how you doing? Alright. Greetings again, Dave. Hope the holiday season has been good to you. I watched your Little Big Planet carding videos. At least someone's watching those. It's a good game, you know. I, I, I have fun with that. Anyway, I've been watching your Little Big Planet uh, carding videos, and it looked like a lot of fun, so I went ahead and bought a copy, and I've been enjoying it since. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the contents of the last package. I'm enjoying them in my mind right now, and like I said, oh, I gotta, I gotta do a video of that, like pronto, pronto. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the contents of the last package, and I also hope you like what's in here. The next package I will try to send before Christmas, and it will contain non-Asian food that time. I uh, hope to send you something special for Christmas or to start the new year with. If you like any particular food I send and would like more of it, just let me know. If you don't get another box by Christmas, then best wishes in life and love to you and your loved ones in the new year. Sincerely, John. That's... This is awesome. This guy puts a lot of uh, thought into uh, the notes. Takes you know a lot of time to write a nice, nice letter, and of course you know the packaging, the the, the placement of the the contents. It's just, uh, and I, I don't even know what else is in there. It's just really nice. We got like another PS. Uh, sorry again for the uh, long letter. I don't have Facebook or YouTube. Oh, you get on Facebook, bruh. I don't have a Facebook or a YouTube page to uh, comment. Although I should probably make one. Anyways. Uh, enjoy Vegas and good stuff. Good stuff indeed. Uh, John, I don't even know what's in here, but I'm going to thank you for it right now. And uh, I got everything. And I, uh, I need to, to get moving and uh, you know, make, a, make a video on some of that cool stuff, you know. And uh, you know, we'll talk about, you know, you don't have to like, get out there and like, totally bust your ass and send me stuff, you know. Uh, I'm just grateful for you sending me anything whenever you get the time, basically, is what I'm saying. But, uh, again, thank you. And let's, uh, let's check out what's in here. Okay. A little something here. little rice porridge with abalone. Oh, oh, that is cool, man. Is this microwavable? Microwavable. Serving directions, heat in boiling water for seven minutes, or use microwave oven, microwave oven cooking, about a minute and minute and a half. Oh, we're doing this. I'm doing this now. I'm doing this tonight. I don't think this is not gross. This sounds yummy. Abalone, man. Rice porridge with abalone. Here, check it out. What do you think? What? I don't even hear anything wiggling. Good stuff, man. Probably like a whole solid block in there. This is, this is pretty cool. Little ventoles and all that good stuff. That's, that's awesome. And I'm hungry. It's dinner time. It's actually late. Okay, we got a... Whoop. What's this? What is this here? I can't... Do you see it yet? Do you know what this is? I don't know what this is yet. Is this upside down? Oh, it is upside down. Preserve duck eggs. There you go. Now you can see. What? Preserved duck eggs. How does this work? Ingredients. Duck eggs, salt, water, tea leaf, sodium, carbonate. What? What is this? Okay, so I can see the duck eggs. You can like, you can see them. Check this out. Might be kind of dark, but look, they're like in there. They're like in there. That's crazy. Little eggs. Duck eggs. <laughs> what am I going to do with these? They're preserved. I guess they're ready to go. I don't know. It's pretty freaky. It's it's very freaky. I've never 
seen anything like this. I've seen some some crazy egg packages and I mean, hey, we got quail eggs in a can. You, you might think that's crazy. I, I think that's meh. I don't know. Quail eggs in a can. But this, this is crazy. I can almost touch them. Touch them. This has to be in a video because this is like really, really gnarly and cool. So, mm, we're going to be doing that. But it is kind of one of the grosser things. I think I made a promise that I would eat like one of the gross things. But, uh, oh no. Hold on. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh, you want to know what this is? Silkworm pupa in a can. You seeing that? No, really. I said, are you seeing that? Oh, no. Oh, I made a promise, didn't I? This, this is, you know, I mean, these things, I put these things on, like, my Amazon wish list, and, you know, if you can talk the talk, man, it's time that we start, uh, eating the eat. I don't know. Um, hello there. There's a website. Yudong, two, two O's, yudong.co.kr. Put that, put that in. Open a tab, okay? Go check that out. All right, silkworm pupa, product of Korea. Mmm, canned silkworm. Yummy. It's dinner time. Okay, I think I'm going to be eating that in this video. Is there anything else? We got a... Oh, this, this is fun. Oh, there's a note. Is that... I don't know what this is. Is this attached to the can? A few items I saw on your Amazon uh, wish list. Right there, a little note in there. Little note. Yeah, yeah, some of these items are on my Amazon wish list. Uh, this is uh, Spam Classic Flavor Macadamia Nuts, by the way. That's a nice snack. Spam Classic Flavor. Hello. Okay. Man, this guy is just sending me so many, like, cool things. Ingredients, dry roasted, Hawaiian macadamia nuts, salt and spam, brand flavoring. Cool. I think I'll munch on some of these. Let's see. I think there's another little note. What was this attached to? Boil prior to consumption. What? What, what does this go to? What does this go to? Boil what? Which one? The eggs? Are those eggs? Or not the bugs, right? Not the pupas. What are we? The macadamia nuts? What are we boiling? Is it something else? What's in here? Oh, little. What is this? Let me move that over there. This box. This box is <laughs> is in the way. I feel. Okay. Oh, look at this. Tamarind candy, artificially flavored. Hey, a neat little thing, you know? Hmm, a lot of sugar and some glucose. Go back, all right? That could be fun. I might munch on one of these things because, man, I want to munch on one of these things. <laughs> like, like the larvae or the uh, the pupas. Whoa. Okay, that this is funky, and I believe. I believe that's the last, you know, that's the last one. No more. <laughs> this guy's sending me a feast. No more. Okay, this is uh, preserved sweet and sour mango with chili. That's so funky. It's like, you know, no air is in this bag. Just suctioned out, you know, and it's right in this thing. Check that out. <laughs> that's like, that's funky gnarly, man. That's cool. So many, and by the way, I don't know, like, uh, if he, like, picks out, you know, John, if he picks out, like, specific different things, like, you know, like, mango, and then, like, nuts, like, crazy soups, and, and insects, and then eggs, and oh, a little candy, you know, a little candy for dessert, you know, after your insects, finish your insects, Dave, okay? How many, how many insects are in here? Does it say how many? Um, uh, if it does, I, I don't know. I don't know, I can't, I can't read some of this. <laughs> Uh, enough. Hey, oh, I know what you're all waiting for. I need a drink. Maybe I'll get some of uh, 
Maggie Mags's beer that was sent to me in video number two. You know, the uh, the beer from the West. It's a nice beer. I still got like still got five of it left. You know, I haven't had one since. Okay, so you know, John, thanks again. This is this is awesome. I'll get in touch with you, uh, and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna try some of this stuff here. Maybe we should. Uh, I still have one package to open, but maybe we should. Uh, we should try something now. Let's see. Um, <laughs> why don't we? We could save that for for last. How about some? Let's just start off with some spam classic flavor macadamia nuts. You know, I can I, I can give you my honest opinion. Are these tasty macadamia nuts, or is this a little odd? You know, is this a little strange? All right, little. Whoa, mama. Okay. There we go. Okay, so kind of seeing that can. I hope you know, just kind of. Hey, macadamia nuts. Okay. Oh man. <laughs> Those are tasty. Hmm. They're good, you know, I actually like these. Alright, I felt like I had to get a couple things. Uh, number one, I had to get a great white beer. Hey, hey. And, uh, I don't know, wiping cloth. Uh, and a bowl for, I don't know, any remains of whatever. I, I don't know why. Just, just because. There's a bowl. I don't know. So, uh, silkworm pupa. Oh, yes. I'm going to open her up. going to, whoop, flip it up. Okay. We're doing this, okay? This is happening. Mm. Damn, this thing is, is really on there. No one is stealing these. No one is... Uh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. In a way, it's not as bad as I thought, and then in, a, in another way, it's just like, holy shit, okay? You want to see this a little closer? I told you. I told you, man. Ooh, silkworm pupas. You want me to shake it a little more? Does that make it better for you guys? Does that make it better if I shake it? Shake, shake, shake. Shake it, shake it. Oh, God. Oh. Yes, yes, folks. This is going to be a tasty treat. Mmm, yummy. Oh, 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 how close can we get? All right, let's do this. Okay, and last but not least, spoon. Got myself a spoon. Okay, I can do this. I am gonna do this. No, it's really. Uh, whoa. Okay, I'm digging. <laughs> I am digging deep down. There is a. There's a lot more. <laughs> Thought it might be like two dozen, but how many's in here? Okay. Oh man. We don't need the juice, do we? We can just, uh... Okay, here we go. <laughs> here we go. I'm not nervous at all, man. This is no problem. I do this every day. I do this every day. Okay, ready? Just wanna... Just don't drip. Get a good view. See that? Hey, now. Hey, now. Okay. Oh, hey, now. Okay, here we go. <laughs> where's my uh, where's my reward money for my reality show for this? You know, I just think. Hmm. Um. It tastes like uh. Tastes like nothing. I just hope it tastes like nothing when it leaves me. You know what I mean? Yeah, there you go. Oh, I'll just have a couple more. What's the big deal? No big deal, you know. It's all good, you know. Just seems fine. What's your problem? I'm playing it cool. Could you play it this cool? Mmm. I think I will have a little beer. Oh, 
little juice, a little juice on my hand. You got my dog Bailey. As you can see, he's uh, he seems a little interested. Bailey, are you interested in what I'm eating? Does it sound like it could be something for you? Would you like a little pupa? <laughs> a little silkworm pupa? Why don't we get you? How about just one? You know, there's nothing wrong with trying new things. I'm just gonna dump that in there. Okay. Yeah, I can touch it. I haven't touched my food here. Ooh. Oh, yeah. There you go. Bailey, what's this? It's a cookie. Doggies like cookies, don't they? Oh. Okay, well, maybe not. Bailey. Oh, are you sure you don't want to try? He dropped it. Second thoughts, Bailey? It's a cookie. Yes, get the cookie. Oh, no. Oh, wait. <laughs> he, he keeps dropping it out. Come on. Ooh, yummy. Come on. Salt. It has salt. Who doesn't like the taste of salt? Mmm. Go get it. Are you good? Are you going to get it? No, just don't lick at it, man. Oh. Oh, no. Wait. He's going. Okay. No. Bailey, make up your mind, Brie. Come on. Okay. Oh, he's munching. Is it? No! He, he spit it out! Bailey, a dog hair. Bailey! Oh, oh man. He's a cookie! Mmm! You got it this time? Come on, man! I fed you llama. I fed you camel. I fed you so many things. Peacock. I fed him snake. Did he eat it? He ate it! Hey! He's a winner! <laughs> Alright, man. Good job! What did you think of your first uh, silkworm pupa? You know? I mean, was it good or... or? Mmm. Mm, got some of the liquid that time. That's really good. I'm very serious. Bailey, these things are just delish, you know? Mm. Want another? Mmm. It takes a lot for him. It, oh, it fell. I mean, he ate it, but, uh, come on, buddy. Come on. You can do it. He did it. Did you do it? Good job, buddy. No, no, the, 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 the macadamia nuts and the, the candies for me, you know? Would you like the rest of this? Because I sure would. Oh, okay. I don't know. Why not, you know? We don't want to waste food. Can't waste food. Ah. I just wanted to give you that shot because, you know, it's probably not gross at all. Maggie Mag sent me beer from the West Coast. Something I've never seen before. Great white. What? Mmm. John sent me bugs in a can. No, no, but I, I did ask for it. I didn't even ask for that. I asked for this. Oh. Okay, honestly, it's like eating nothing. There's no taste. It, it's mushy, and, uh, and that's it, you know? No biggie. It's a little funky. It's a little weird. You know, it's a little... It's a little strange, right? You know? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Two for me, none for you. Mmm. Well, Bailey, thanks for being with me for this, uh, this portion of the eating video. You know? Thanks. Oh, man, it's been quite the uh, little adventure here in this vid. Craziest one yet? I'd say so. Uh, anyway, I went down and I microwaved my uh, rice porridge with abalone. I don't think that microwave was very kind of the, like the plastic on the sides. It's kind of kind of odd, but uh, here we go. Let's 
Still feels hot. Man, a little plastic coming off. And they give you a little spoon and then like there's some soy sauce and seasoning and I mixed that in already. If you, uh, if you can see, just don't want to get any plastic in there. Look at this thing. It's like a spoon for you, Bailey. Here we go. Hmm. I think this is going to be a, a nice little treat here to follow my other treat. Okay. Here we go. Hey, rice porridge with abalone. Good stuff. Abalone is kind of like a clam. It's drippy. Okay. You know, it's warm. Warm is nice. Um, not a lot of flavoring. I feel like I have to take fast bites because the bites are so small. You know, look at this thing. No, no, I'm not using that spoon. A little abalone in here. Yummy. Yeah, so I mean, these... These are like little rice and whatnot in a can for like a dollar fifty, and I mean this is what you get. I mean it's nothing bad or anything. It's but it's like you know it's fast cooking. You know what I mean? It's nice. It's tasty. Hmm. It's a nice little warm treat, you know. No. Hey. Now that's a nice taste. Wipe my mouth there. All right. Hmm. Abalone. That's good stuff. It's good stuff. Hmm. You can't argue with that. You can't argue with that. That's good. That's nice. That's uh, I like these nuts a lot, though. These spam flavored macadam macadamia nuts. Hey, those are nice. Okay, uh, there's a couple food products left. Uh, you know, like egg products, but we're gonna save those for another video. Not to mention, John has sent me prior to this a whole bunch of other foods, which I still haven't gotten to. So we'll add this. We'll add a lot of this. I'm thinking maybe like two vids for all this stuff, you know? It's just a lot to a lot to eat, and it's going to be awesome. So thank you again. This is great. And really nice of you to send me all this stuff. All right, I wanted to save this package here for the end. This is from Adam from Denmark. Denmark. He sent me this from Denmark. That's so awesome. I mean, come on. That, uh... I mean, someone... Someone named Adam took the time to put whatever is in here, in here, ship it all up, send it from Denmark all the way to me in Pennsylvania. I mean, come on. Hello. We still got Mr. Knife here. This is a unusual package. Here we go. This is what we cut. So I'm just going to open this up and see what, uh, see what we got here. Good stuff. All right. Okay, kind of opens from the back. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Okay, excuse me, what stuff? Good lord. Okay, open it up. You can see. Let's, uh, I want this falling on my foot. <laughs> okay. Don't want it to get cold. Okay, so right away I see like a cool postcard. I don't want to look at what's... Okay, cool. I didn't... Came off easily. I don't want to rip this. I want to save this. I save all my, you know, my letters and all my stuff. A little kind of a postcard thing, sort of. Some writing on the back. All right, let's check this out. Thanks for all the uh, good hours of entertainment. You were one of uh, the first Let's Players I followed. The first was Anne Can Tafis Third. My favorite moment was when you made prank calls during your desert bus walkthrough, called Pizza Hut, and got hold of Erica. Erica! Uh, in Desert Bus First Ride, Part 8. Part 8. Let's talk about uh, Desert Bus. There's more, but quick, quick couple mentions about Desert Bus. Um, probably most of you know 
Um, it was an unreleased game. It was called uh, Penn and Teller Smoke and Mirrors. There's a couple games on it. One was called Desert Bus, which was a bus simulation game uh, where you drive from like uh, Arizona to Vegas or something. And it was like real time. It's like driving a bus. And there's day and night. And uh, that's pretty much it. Oh, like a bug will fly on your windshield. The wipers don't work because that, that would make sense. I think the gas is always on E. That makes sense. It, it, whatever. Um, it was unreleased, but uh, a lot of people play it for various reasons. It's like it's so bad you got to play this for hours and hours. You know, there's charities. There's people just doing walkthroughs of it. I've done how many hours have I done? Like like 32. I did. I did a couple runs, <clears throat> and uh, due to a lot of the content on the videos. It's just, it's not for YouTube, if you know what I mean. Um, I actually have a Daily Motion account um, on my main YouTube page that, you know, links to certain videos, uh, Desert Bus in particular. You know, I still have to upload the rest of Desert Bus to my Daily Motion account. Maybe this will give me the boost to do, you know, the rest. But I believe that part eight is, uh, you know, is at least on there. You know, he's talking about Desert Bus First Ride Part Eight. And I think that's, I think that's on there. But I, I, I really need to get on my Daily Motion account, upload uh, the Desert Bus. Anyway, if you want to check out the whole Desert Bus and, you know, my walkthrough of it, uh, go there and uh, hopefully it's updated soon. Anyway, the rest of the note says, I have sent some licorice candy, which is often difficult to buy outside of Denmark. At least the strong versions. Hope you like it. Sincerely, Adam. Snufkin224. <laughs> Alright, Adam. Awesome. Uh, licorice candy from from Denmark that's that's awesome you know people like spend a lot of money to get like exotic candies from like different parts of the world and you know hey how about I just have some like plop in my lap that's awesome hey, come on man can I okay woo look at kind of all right it's big it's large show the back it's like four cans I think something like that okay let's Let's open it up. Thanks again, man. Okay. I'll just open this up with my hands. Mm. Yeah. Alright, there we go. Careful. Ooh, man, this is... This just looks like cool looking. Let me just take these out. Oh, there's... There's four of these. It's a lot of bubble wrap. And then there's this little thing. Haribo? Haribo. Interesting. Oh man, I can't... I can't read most of this. Piratos. Haribo Piratos. Is this, is this the licorice? Kids and grown-ups love it so. The happy world of Haribo. Oh man. Okay, let's uh... Check this out. That's pretty cool, man. Huh. That is pretty cool. <laughs> I can't just go to the the store and buy this kind of stuff. Not 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 around here. Yeah, it's uh it's soft. I think this is like licorice type stuff. I mean, he said licorice, but then we have like four of these. Oh, four of these here. Lac lacrids. Salty licorice. I think this might be a different kind. I can. That's a salty licorice, um, and the rest is uh, unreadable by me. All right. This is neat. I, yeah, I gotta try this. I have to try this. Uh, salty licorice. Oh, this is sweet licorice. Salty and sweet. All right. Cool. And we have uh, chili licorice. <laughs> Christmas chalk coated licorice. You know, I gotta try like one of each. I gotta try. I gotta try them all. This is this is so cool. Right from Denmark. Any uh, crazy like licorice fans out there? You're gonna wish you had these. Hey. hey. All right, good stuff. Let's uh, let's check these out. I'm gonna have uh, let's pull out one piece from each. Keep them straight here. Okay, salty licorice. All right. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Oh, that is salty. 
That's really crazy. Hmm. Wow, that's like really interesting. I can just, uh, I can like detect the saltiness. That's pretty cool, man. And uh, sweet, sweet and the, uh, the chili one. Let's try sweet. Yeah, I can feel it, you know, just, you know, that one has like, like they're all the same. They just have different tastes, you know, like texture-wise, they're the same, but... Mmm. That one... That one I like better. This is, uh... The Chili Licorice. Okay. Oh, man, I don't know what to expect. Hmm. Huh. Yeah, it's got like a kick. It's got like an interesting kick to it, you know, like a chili kick. That's a. Uh, I like the salty and the uh, the sweet one. Those are pretty cool. All right, now it's time for these babies. Ready? I uh, opened it up. Let's check it out. Hmm, they're chewy. <laughs> these are like crazy chewy. Really chewy. Uh, sweet. Seems sweet too. And really good. It's just that kind of chewy candy stuff, you know what I mean? <laughs> but I like it. What haven't I eaten in this video? Crazy candies from Denmark. Um, like abalone uh, stew. Insects. You know, uh, spam macadamia nuts. I'm doing it all and there's still, there's still crazy leftovers like quail and duck eggs you know this is crazy guys everyone i just want to thank you again for all the cool funky stuff man it's been a blast this has been like the craziest mailbox opening you know unboxing yet and uh you know there's still stuff i have to check out and do videos for and you know it's just great and uh, i just want to tell you thanks and i appreciate you know all the effort you took and all the work you know in sending these things it's just awesome all right, guys, so look down below in the video description. My, my mailbox address is there. If you want to send me something, send it to me there at that address. I'll get it. I'll make a video of it. Good stuff. I hope you enjoyed. And, uh, you know, leave me a comment or two or three about everything that's been going on in this video and tell me what you think. Tell me your, tell me your thoughts on, on what went down in here, okay? And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I'm Dave the Usher. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. I am out.